Hello, welcome, Cabbage here. In War of the Visions, there is a, a JP YouTuber that I like, uh, Shimura, and uh, he did a video where he showed himself uh, filling out the, uh, the survey. And I thought that was a fun idea for a video, so I'm going to steal that, and I'll do that here. So let's go in. Okay, first I'm going to put in my uh, player ID. Okay, asking me for my gender, male, and my age. Somewhere in there. And let's see, how often do I play smartphone games? Just about every day. And in one day, how much do I play? Well, I guess including uh, farming on auto battle or whatever. That would be over four hours. Okay, and then check all the Final Fantasies that you have played before. <laughs> all right, I played Final Fantasy 1 in real time, I should add. Uh, 2 and 3 played lightly. 4, 5, and 6 played those a lot. 7 also played that, but on PC. Uh, tactics I played. 8 never did play. 9 and 10 and 10, 2 played all those. Uh, Final Fantasy Tactics Advanced never really played that. Uh, 11, no. 12, yes. Uh, Tactics War of the Lions, that's the, um, I guess the upgraded version with the uh, the cutscenes. I have played that. Final Fantasy Tactics A2, never really played that. 13, didn't play any of those. 14, didn't play that. 15, yes. And then uh, mobile games, uh, Opera Omni, no. BE, yes. Record Keeper, briefly. Okay, great. Next, where do I get my information about uh, War of the Visions? YouTube. Community sites? I guess Reddit counts. Uh, the homepage? Yeah, sometimes. Twitter? Yes. Famitsu or other magazines? Don't read the magazines, but I look at their websites. I don't know if that counts. Uh, let's see. Uh, Koryaku site. That means like Altema or something, yes. Friends, no. Cagebone, no. Uh, the official channel, yes. Ah, uh, yeah, here we are. Famitsu app. So I'll uncheck the magazine one. Other Twitter. Yeah, I follow other people on Twitter. They give me info. And let's see, how did I start War of the Visions? Mm, let's see. I guess I'll check this one, Brave Exvius. Uh, you know, I was playing that for a couple years, and then in the uh, one of the uh, live streams they announced War of the Visions, so I knew about it there. And let's see, what kind of game, or how well known is the game? My impression. Uh, the first one says everybody knows about it. Second one says people that know games know about it. Third one says only hardcore gamers know about it. I guess. I'll do the middle one. Let's see. Describe your kind of play, your heaviness of play with the game. Among my installed games, it's one that I play the most, uh, or I kind of play it, or I just log in, or I don't have a lot of motivation, or I don't really play. It's the most, it's the one that I play the most right now. Okay, and then uh, pick three of the main contents that you enjoy. Mm, let's see, main story, guild quest, multi-quest, arena. Mm. I like the uh, selection quest. Those are those uh, MR and lower rarity uh, quests. And I like uh, this one. This is the uh, three-star Esper fights. What else? Quest raid. I guess it would come down to arena or raids. Uh, we'll do arena. Okay. And then pick the three contents that you would like improved. And, okay, I can choose first, second, or third here. 
I know exactly the one that I want them to work on the most, and that is the Trial of Reckoning. Don't like that one. <laughs> Otherwise... Mm, rematch. Main story, class match, character quest. Guild battles, three star. Mm, I don't have any problems with any of these, really. I guess uh, multi-quests, I want more like like maybe high difficulty stuff where you can team up with other people. Uh, that's not a raid, it's like a, a big boss or something, that would be cool. Uh, what's the third one? Oh, I guess a uh, guild quest? That could be like uh, kind of similar to the multi-quest where you team up with uh, guild mates to beat uh, difficult stuff. Let's make that two, actually. Maybe multi-quest we'll get rid of. Let's put other. <laughs> That's nice and vague. Hmm? It won't let me go to the next one. Kamarazu Kaito. Hmm? Oh, let me go. All right. It says you chose the Trial of Reckoning. Why did you choose that? I am Sugimas. <laughs> I just put that uh, it takes too much work. Way too much work. I was only able to make a uh, like a ribbon plus four in uh, either version, either JP or global. It's it's just too much. And then of all of the mini stories, which one did you enjoy the most? Hmm. Mm. Maybe this was the one with Miranda? Was that the one? Miranda, O, and uh, Seymour. If that's it, then I liked that one, so we'll go with that. And am I reading the main story? Of course. And what do you like about the main story? Mm. I like... I like the world, maybe. I've talked about this in a uh, previous video, but I feel like the world has great potential, uh, but they haven't really fleshed it out enough. Uh, there's not enough like uh, history and mythology and maps, of course, so I'll type that into here, maybe. Okay, I like the world. I want to know more about the history and mythology of Ardra. Alrighty. And have I ever spent money in the game? Yes, I have. Within the last year. <laughs> and when was the first time that you spent and why? I don't think I remember for War of the Visions. I remember I did not spend to pull in Final Fantasy XIV uh, when it was first released because I felt like it wasn't worth it. I felt like Thancred was a trap immediately. <laughs> uh, it might have been Christmas. I might have started spending on Christmas. But I pulled Christmas Mashiri on Christmas Day in a free pull. I did... I did pull for Ramada, but I never got her. I wonder if I spent for that. I skipped tactics. I just built up a uh, Gafgarion. I can't remember. Uh, we'll just put Christmas. <laughs> okay. Timing Christmas. Why I wanted Ramada. All right. Uh, next, how much are you enjoying the story? I would say pretty good. And how are you enjoying the summons of the game? Uh, pretty good. I feel like my luck has been pretty good overall. Uh, it is an expensive game, but if we're just talking about summons, then I guess that's good. And then uh, leveling units. I enjoy it. 
It does take a lot of work, but uh, once you get into it, you get kind of a runner's high and you start enjoying it. <laughs> uh, next, how do you feel about the battle? I like it very much. Uh, how do you feel about PvP? It's good, but it's not my personal focus in playing the game. But yeah, when I do play it, I do enjoy it. And then co-op play. Yeah, this again, I think needs some help. I would like more uh, like uh, going in there with your guildmates to fight some kind of hard boss. That would be fun. Uh, this is about the graphics. Vision cards. Yes, they are great. 2D graphics, great. Uh, 3D graphics, we'll put here. I have one request about the 3D graphics on like uh, Sasayaki or Orodoa or Jiza. They have that apron going down their front. If you could like detach that from their knees Liberate those thighs. I would really appreciate that. What limit break do you like? I like all of the uh, seasonal ones. They're kind of uh, they're kind of funny. They're kind of tongue in cheek. Okay, I like the seasonal limit breaks. They have a uh, sense of humor. Next, vision card. Which vision card illustration do you like? I think I have to look at my uh, app, see what the names of the cards are. <laughs> okay, I put in Trousseau and Snow White Guard and the uh, Liot card, the, uh, the Day Off, whatever, uh, because they strike me as the most like tarot cards. They're like facing right ahead. I like those, I think. Okay, next. How do you feel about playing the game in various ways? Uh, the first one, let's see. You can choose either you want more time to play or you want less time to play. Mm, this could go either way. I guess it's fine the way it is. I don't feel like I'm really being uh, left behind with how much I'm playing. And leveling guys, do you feel like it's too much or not enough? Or it's not challenging enough? I think it's fine. Uh, pace of events, it's fine. Uh, new summon, the pace. Mm, I guess it's fine. I'm not super happy about how strong all of the, uh, the very recent uh, units are in JP. We're seeing a little bit less uh, variety at the uh, top of PvP. And then... The end, how do you feel about the pace of uh, stuff to do? I feel fine. I'm able to set limits for myself, so I don't feel like I have to do everything, so it's all fine. If you were to introduce this game to a friend, what would you tell them? I would tell them that more than a Final Fantasy game, this is more like a, a Tactics Ogre game, as far as the, uh, the world and play. And then, what other mobile game have you played where you really enjoyed the uh, story, or like, you played the game for the story? I'll put in uh, Kotobuki. <laughs> What movies or anime have you been interested in lately? Well, I watched uh, Dororo lately. That is a... Um, that was a uh, comic by uh, Tezuka Osamu. Uh, and then it was recently remade into a uh, recent anime. It is way better than Kimetsu no Yaiba. <laughs> uh, and it kind of uh, applies. It's kind of uh, similar maybe in themes or kind of world uh, to War of the Visions, so that could be appropriate. Uh, Game of Thrones, I guess I watched that semi-recently, and that's also kind of related to War of the Visions. And I haven't watched this particular one lately, but I've been watching like other Fate stuff, and then like I think this is also kind of similar-ish to uh, War of the Visions. Uh, Fate Zero. If you've never seen this, I can highly recommend it. 
Okay, and then last question, I guess. This is just a uh, free thing. I'll uh, talk about how I want uh, more maps in the game. Okay, I said I want to look at the maps at my leisure. I want to see the mountains, the rivers, the forests, the roads, the villages, and the castles. I want to know like more exactly where they are. And in Game of Thrones or Lord of the Rings, uh, the maps are very important in kind of understanding and also enjoying the story. So I want that in War of the Visions as well. Okay, that should be it. Send. Okay, that's it. Hopefully we will see some maps soon in the game. Alright, that'll do it for this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again. Take care.